This is the impossible pull-up, the ultimate test of strength, because one rep for this pull-up is two minutes long. So clearly, this is extremely hard, and I had to ask myself, could I possibly complete the impossible pull-up? First, I'm gonna try an easier version of this pull-up, 30 seconds up, 30 seconds down, which is still a minute pull-up. It's going to be really hard, but we'll see if I can get that first. Boom, and we are off. This is my first attempt ever on the impossible pull-up. I really had no idea what to expect, except that this challenge is extremely hard. That's why I started with just 30 seconds up and 30 seconds down. And as you can see already right off the bat, my pacing is way off. I've pulled way too high, way too early. And so I knew that and I was like, crap, I'm already off. And this is only a minute. The full challenge is two minutes. This is going to be way harder than I thought. My arms are already shaking at 30 seconds. This is crazy. This is is going to be a brutal, brutal challenge. My first thought with that is it's super hard to get the timing right. I couldn't determine how high I needed to pull up or pull down. It was actually super, super challenging and it was hard on top of that. Just strictly pulling for a minute straight was difficult. The whole two minute impossible pull up is going to be an extreme challenge. It's definitely gonna take a few attempts, but I know we can get this. That's super exciting. Day two of this impossible pull-up challenge. Today, we are going to be attempting 45 seconds up, 45 seconds down, and then if we send that, we're gonna be going for the full thing. A minute up, a minute down, impossible pull-up. Let's get it. 45 seconds up, 45 seconds down. We just gotta get right into it. Let's go. Okay, this being my second attempt on the impossible pull-up, my goal here was really to get the timing down because the timing on my first one was actually terrible and I feel like that made it a million times harder. So this time, 45 seconds up, 45 seconds down, I made sure to pace myself through it, which was still extremely tricky. And early on, I found myself getting into a rhythm, which was nice, but this got insanely hard. 45 seconds up and 45 seconds down was a million times harder than 30 up and 30 down. And this got me really, really worried but I was really starting to feel it around the halfway mark and uh, I just really had to push through it was brutal but I wanted it so so bad and so going into the final one I'm super excited but I was learning my way through this one I was really trying to feel it and I don't know if you can tell but my arms were shaking so much at this point in the challenge so this pull up is definitely way harder than it looks so hard doing this for you boss fam go down there and smash that subscribe button smash the like button because i'm doing this for you oh i dare y'all to try this this is brutal okay 45 seconds up 45 seconds down definitely got a lot of pump in my arms and my arms in the middle of that were shaking more than i think they ever have doing any exercise this challenge is insane if y'all remember over the summer i tried the impossible push-up was about 30 seconds off from this i'm currently 30 seconds off of the impossible pull-up it's going to be way harder though i'm going to get this challenge but whew, this is going to be a grind this is brutally hard the other really hard part about this is how are you going to train for it? You literally just have to do it. It's not like a muscle up. It's not like any other exercise where you can work on techniques and whatnot. This is just straight pulling for two minutes and the only way to work on it is actually by doing the exercise. It's crazy. Third attempt at the impossible pull up. Here we go. This is what everyone's been waiting for. A minute up, a minute down. This is going to hurt, but we're going to go for it. Boss fam, this is for you. Smash the like button and subscribe. Let's get it. 
And here we go. This is my last attempt at the impossible pull up and going into it, I knew that. I knew my body could not take another attempt and this was going to be it. The entire day, I was tired, I was worn out, my arms were shaking, my core was tired right when I started this and I knew this was going to be my last ditch effort to try to complete the impossible pull up for me, my family, my subscribers. This was it. And 25 seconds in, I felt super calm, super relaxed. I was just trying to sing songs in my head, trying to do anything to pass the time and really get the pacing down which I feel like I had mastered at this point in the challenge which was super super exciting. Coming across the minute mark, that's when this challenge really started to ramp up and I really started to get tired. My head was above the bar only for a split second of time and my arms were already starting to give out and I'm only halfway into this challenge. So I really just tried to fight it, tried to save it, pushed through all the pain that I had, even though this was some of the worst pain ever. This challenge is extremely, extremely difficult and you just see me fighting for every inch at this point, but I'm way off of pace now. My arms are past 90 degrees, which you want them to be there at 1. 30 and my arms are just giving out at this point I'm just fighting to get to a minute 40 a minute 45 something in that area because my arms are struggling so so bad wow that was heartbreaking to say the least we were 15 seconds away from completing the impossible pull up that was insanely hard a true test of strength I want y'all to try that. Comment down below what y'all get for time. That is brutal. Also, if you want me to do a follow-up video where I actually try to take down this impossible pull-up again, please comment that down below. Appreciate you, Boss Fam. I love y'all. Please go try this. This is awesome. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.